In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install Docker on Linux Mint. Before we cover the installation, what is Docker and why should you be using it? Docker, in its essence, is a container for your server-based applications. This container is easy to manage, it's easy to back up, it's super easy to move your Docker image from one computer to another, and last but not least, it scales incredibly well. So let's show you how to install it. There are several guides on the internet for installing Docker. In this guide, we're going to try to do it the simple way. Now, this may not totally work on your machine. I will include a tutorial, an actual link to the setup in the video description for this guide, but I'll also include one or two others just in case this method doesn't work for you. You can try those. So let's get started. First, we're going to open a terminal. Now we're going to run this following commands in this order, sudo apt dash get update it's going to ask me for my password which which we're going to supply okay with that done we're going to go sudo apt dash get upgrade nothing there but we'll continue on sudo apt install docker.io select yes now back at the prompt you're going to run the next following commands sudo s y s t e m c t l start space docker okay now you're going to type in sudo S Y S T E M C T L enable space Docker. Okay. Now what we're going to do is S U D O S Y S T E M C T L status space Docker. Okay. We can see Docker is running. So Docker is installed. But we have to check for a few things. We have to make sure Docker stays running through a restart. So let's actually do that. Let's restart the system. Okay, great. It's nice and quick. First, we'll make sure Docker is registered with the system, which it is. Docker commands do work. So Docker dash V. That's our current build. So before we call it a day, we're going to run a test to make sure Docker is fully working, uh, which is sudo docker space run space hello da dash dash world. And put my password. It's getting the image. Hello world from Docker. This doc, this message shows that your installation appears to be working correctly. It contacted the Docker daemon, downloaded the hello world image. So there you go. Now that Docker's installed, we're going to install Docker Compose. So back at the terminal, you're going to type in the following command. sudo space apt space install space docker dash compose. Press enter and now enter your password. The system will now ask you, do you want to confirm the installation? Do you want to go ahead with it? Press Y to continue and let it do its thing. Once done, we're going to verify the installation by typing in docker dash compose space version. And there you have it. Docker compose has been installed. Now we have to move on to the last step, which is setting the permissions. To see if you have to set these permissions, type in the following command docker space container space ls and if you're met with this permission error got permission denied while trying to connect to the docker daemon socket then you need to adjust your permissions you can do that by typing in these following commands sudo space group add space docker press enter type in your password now sudo space g pass wd space dash a 
space money sign curly bracket user capital curly bracket space docker press enter and then last but not least su space dash space money sign capital user press enter enter your password and you're basically done from this point restart your computer so we can check it one last time with the computer restarted open up the terminal and try it again docker space container space ls and there you have it we're good permissions are good you're ready to go with docker hopefully this video was helpful and as always guys if you like this video and want more like it do me a favor like comment and subscribe i'm fix it fix it fix it i'll see you next time